everyone. Okay, so this is going to be my book on it on the Claire Ricketts um, autobiography. And that's the front, and that is the back. Now I'm going to be really specific on this because I uploaded this the other day, and it was, it was yesterday, and it wouldn't go up because it was too long. So I'm just going to keep this short. Um, she was born on the 17th, 17th of August 1977 and it was the 16th of August when Elvis Presley died. She grew up with her mum and dad and Gemma and she always wanted to perform and she um, created this band called Cindy Queen Sweeners because she was a fan of Cindy Doll when she was younger and she um and then she um, auditioned, she did, she was in a play called Maria, she was a voice of Maria because she did sound music and she just told us about this audition. She went down to Surrey in 1997 and then that's when she joined Steps. Through the years of Steps she started losing weight, she got told before she joined to lose the weight. She was a size 8, 10 to 12. She lost the weight and she went to a size 8 before she, when she joined and then she started losing the weight when she was in the band. And she got to the point where she was making herself sick and no one in the band knew because everyone else had their pro uh, other problems and no one liked conversation so every time something got brought up no one mentioned it. H from Steps had an affair with their manager and that's when because she got told from the beginning when Pete Watson played all the music she said you're the voice of the, of the, um, the group she didn't like it. And that's why I was a bitch in the start because she had to leave vocals and everyone was going well. And then when they rejoined, they said, well, I think it's best if they start, then me or you start in in the in the in the um in and then me or you come in for the like chorus or the you know so we all have individual um singing. So that went on and then um she was seeing this guy called Beast. And they had this little bit of a fling. Apparently, he already had a girlfriend, and she found out, like, they found out that she, he was pregnant, and the whole world chatted. So then she said, um, she, and that's when she left, and she got really down, and then she met this guy called Mark, who was a backing dancer. And when she left Steps, she and him didn't have anything in common anymore. And then H and Claire joined a reunion of this, um, starting their own career. And then that went to pot, and then she left when she gained the weight to 22 stone. Went on to Chef, no one knew who she was. Laura lost the weight, and went on stop birth, so it was up a star after that, and then she did. And then she got pregnant again in 2009, and then, and then she got back together with Reese. Apparently, he has a, a, a elder, and um, they had a conversation here and her step, stepdaughter. And I was cool because she's got a stepmom that's famous, so apparently they're, you know, getting on in, in the relationship. And then the regime joins and she said, I'm standing in the arena, a size 14, wearing all these clothes, I don't care. So she went from losing the weight and not eating to gaining weight and couldn't stop eating. So over all the lives, every time everything's got her down, she's always been a slave to food. And then... Um, so yeah, she's at the end of it, she said, um, I got, no one could be anyone but me. I'm a good, I'm the best thing to my children since I sliced bread. Okay, so that's an overview of this book. Um, I think it's a little bit short, but I had to keep it short because it was too long to upload. So if you guys enjoy it, go check it out. And I will leave the link in the bottom bar below where to buy it. And I might start doing games video with I've got an Xbox 360 so I'll be able to do games. But another that on but another update on that when I do a vlog. Thank you guys for watching, take care and I shall see you next time. Bye.